right, guys, so we got the solo squat. And then one thing that you want to be paying attention to, you know, is your, t your second toe needs to be lined up with your knee here when you're doing these type of exercises on the BOSU. So second toe, the knees kind of needs to stay in traction with that line. One thing you will probably will notice is your knee may come on over your toe, and that's okay. If that bothers your knee for any reason, you can use straps to lean back, get back in the hip a little deeper, or you can limit the range of motion, or use a post to hold on to while you're doing the exercise. Now, what you're gonna be doing with your back foot is basically pushing it back against. We're gonna drop that knee to the ground and then push back up. This is called the solo squat. It's, a, it's kind of a variation of the pistol squat, but what you're gonna feel is that hamstring and glute almost attach and act as one muscle group when you're doing this exercise. It'll make you super strong on your leg exercises and help you get where you do not have knee issues. So again, you're pushing that back foot into the pad, so you're not really using it, but it's there for a little stability. You're gonna drop that knee to the ground and then push back up. That is the solo squat.